Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate your time, thank you for watching, and very rarely do I get excited about a bill to the point where I think that every state should mimic this bill. Every state should already have something like this on the books if they implore, or employ rather, uh, gun-free zones. And this is a pretty important uh, bill I wanna talk to you about, and you should do everything you can do to get your legislature to mimic this bill. Here's the bill on the screen. It's Georgia Bill 1364 in the House. Let me read you the opening of the bill because it's pretty phenomenal. And it says to amend Article 1, Chapter 3 of Title 51 of the Official Code of Georgia annotated relating to general provisions regarding liability of owners and occupiers of land so as to provide that a person, business, or other entity that owns or legally controls a property and prohibits the lawful weapons carrier from possessing a concealed weapon on such property shall assume absolute custodial responsibility for the safety of such lawful weapons carrier from certain threats to provide for public notices, to provide for a cause of action for any lawful weapons carrier who is harmed while on certain property after being prohibited by the person, business, or other entity that owns or legally controls such property from possessing a concealed weapon on such property, to provide for damages, to provide for limitations, to provide for definitions, to provide for related matters, to provide for applicability, to repeal conflicting laws, and for other purposes. Let me boil it down for you. If you, in Georgia, if this passes, now Georgia has a very strong uh, legislature, it might not make it through as is because it has no exceptions for government property. That, that's a key. But what this thing looks to do is that if you go to any business, store, restaurant, what have you, that has a uh, no guns allowed sign on it, you know, it's typically a Beretta with a line through it, uh, then they have assumed absolute custodial control and care for you and must provide for your safety and security. And thus, if you are injured or hurt or attacked or shot or worse in their establishment, while they have this sign and have not provided said measures for you, then you can sue the shark out of them. And that is what needs to happen. Yes, I am a big fan of uh, privacy and private ownership of uh, land and businesses and those landowners and business owners can basically control their land. They can do what they want and establishments, should they choose to make people sitting ducks, they better provide for your security. And this bill, if it were to be law, would give people a, uh, a legal action against those establishments should security fail, if they have security at all. Now this bill um, like I said, it, uh, it's in its infancy. It was uh, put in last week. I'll uh, link to the bill down below. But uh, good bill, Georgia, get behind it. It's, uh, again, let me pull it up because my screen just refreshed. HB 1364 in Georgia. A couple other states have had similar bills. They didn't make it very far. Um, because what do you mean? Gun-free zones save lives, don't they? Well, thanks to Joe Biden, who uh, passed the original uh, bill in Congress when he was a senator, uh, 90 plus percent of all mass shootings take place in zones he established. And since he hasn't provided any security for people there, I wonder if that makes him liable. Guys and gals, have a phenomenal day. I just wanted to bring a solid bill to you, a bill that's not bad news, a bill that looks to support and defend freedom and people's individual liberties as well. So with that, hope you have a great day. Subscribe to this channel down below. It's right here in the lower left corner. It's free for you to do, but it tells YouTube that this channel has worthy information, especially if you are a gun owner, considering gun ownership, or even if you're not a gun owner and you still support people's rights, which is what it's all about in this country. We should all support each other's rights, even if we disagree. Guys and gals, have a great day. Be safe, stay vigilant, carry a gun. You are your own first responder. Cops are not... Uh, held liable for your individual safety, which is another bill, another reason this bill ought to pass. Take care.